Remember this guy from the early 2000s who had that one hit song She Will Be Loved with his band Maroon 5? Well, since then, Adam Levine has essentially abandoned his bandmates and their instruments to do whatever he can to chase every single trend and pay big money to whatever the current relevant hip hop star is just so he can stay on the charts and push music to radio that lacks any creativity or inspiration whatsoever. And it's not just his music that's second rate, although I will admit doing literally whatever it takes to make a song that you can put on the radio has worked out pretty well for him. He's also the host of the $5 bargain bin brand version of American Idol, The Voice. So anyways, this absolute goof decided he was going to diss the entire genre of rock music and essentially say that there's nothing interesting happening here, it's all happening in hip hop and R&B. Here's what he had to say, quote, rock music is nowhere really. I don't know where it is. If it's around, no one's invited me to the party. All of the innovation and incredible things happening in music are in hip hop. So obviously Adam Levine isn't exactly a credible source on taste making given the fact that he spent his entire career just copying what everyone else does and then re-releasing a watered down uninspired version of the same thing you heard three years ago. As if that isn't aggravating enough, Maroon 5 has been selected to perform at the Super Bowl halftime show where they're gonna stand up on stage with their instruments and pretend to be a rock band after Adam Levine has insulted rock music and they're gonna take the place of a band like Metallica that's significantly larger than they could ever be but for some reason the NFL has chosen to give people extended bathroom breaks for the halftime show over the last few years. But anyways insert the good man Corey Taylor frontman of Slipknot and Stone Sour who was not going to let this stand and absolutely ripped Adam Levine to shreds. He said, just because you claim to have moves like Jagger doesn't mean you come anywhere close to rocking like Jagger. Tell that schmuck to go back to the f voice. And case in point, Adam Levine is completely destroyed. He also shared this message from Steven Hyden who said, congrats to the rock music party on not inviting Adam Levine. Well said, well said. I mean, seriously, take it from the guy who unironically did a song with Christina Aguilera to tell you about what rock music is doing. But that's why we're fortunate to have somebody like Corey Taylor around who will stand up for the genre and stand up for the fans. We love you, Corey. You get a lot of shit from people, but we appreciate you. So that's all for now. Don't forget to subscribe with notifications on and check the these recommended videos out for more hard rock and heavy metal news. Thanks as always for joining us here at Rock Feed and we'll see you all very soon.